Good evening, I'm Shamika Neely. A new park on the west side of Bloomington opened Tuesday at dawn. Will Detmer Park sits on the corner of Vernal Pike and Curry Pike. The Detmer family donated the 18-acre piece of property to the Monroe County Parks and Recreation Foundation and now features a community garden, a fishing area, and walking trails. Funding for the project came from grants and donations. Administrators say this will eventually link to trails linking to the new YMCA local elementary schools and other area businesses. New procedures regarding public access to files in Monroe County will slow the way public obtains some information about criminal cases. The change arises from two recent pieces of legislation, one which expunges some criminal records after five years. The uh, problem with this is we won't have a file with just the confidential sticker on it. But that indicates that there was a file, and the public can't know that there was ever a file. Robin says the changes will cost her department around $250,000. Community officials are still mulling over final plans at Tuesday's final public meeting for Bloomington Switchyard Park. About 30 people gathered Tuesday afternoon to see the results of nine months of public input and planning of the new park off Grimes Road and the Beeline Trail. To make the plans a reality, officials are identifying ways to fund the park. Parks and Recreation Director Mick Renison says it will be a community asset and attraction for visitors that will come with a hefty price tag. The city has a budgeting process that we're about to conclude for the 2013 budget. Uh, the general fund dollars that come in and are reallocated based on priorities from the council and the mayor and the community would be one of those funding sources. The property is between 57 and 64 acres. Principal project leader Kevin Osborne says the final master plan, phasing options and cost estimates will be revealed on or around September 19th. The challenges really have to do with the site itself, its unique configuration, its size, its scale, its the environmental issues, the floodplain issues. Park amenities include a dog park, splash pad, and basketball court. Renison estimates that the project will take about seven to ten years to complete. Your weather tonight, clear lows in the lower 50s, tomorrow sunny, highs in the mid-80s.